I see it in your eyes Yeah, I can read the signs You need to get away It's time we make a change Oh, you know you'll always have me Baby, I will always stay with you So put your trust in to head into my local Target and see the new spring decor items that are coming out in the dollar spot as well as in a few other areas of the store. I'm very excited to head in. As you know, I love Target. I love getting to be your eyes and show you these things so that if you would like to add any of them to your collection, you can head to a local Target and hopefully find them for yourself. I am very much enjoying this new Target. It's been open for about five months. I did do a vlog here when this particular Target was not even technically open. They did a soft launch and it was a really neat experience to go into this Target when it technically wasn't open. It just was a very unique opportunity and even though it didn't really come with any real perks or anything, it just felt cool. So I do have that vlog up on my channel if you are itching to see what a brand new Target looks like. Uh, but we're gonna get in there and see the sights. So let's go. Sharing with you my favorite Starbucks drink before we head in, it is the Strawberry Acai Lemonade. I get it with light ice and seven strawberry inclusions. My favorite number is seven, fun fact. So that's my justification for why I think I need seven scoops of strawberries. And I opt for light ice, a little hack here, because then I end up with way more drink. So I have been sipping on that. I'm gonna leave it here in the car as I head in to Target. It's the back at home version of Brittany, but I'm popping in at this point in the video because I want to let you know that this is a long one. So go ahead and grab a snack, a drink, cozy up, get ready to see every last item that is new in the Target dollar spot, which is pretty much everything we saw today, hence the length of this video, or even multitask, grab an AirPod, pop that in, go about some cleaning, folding laundry, and take a glance over when you hear me talking about something you might be interested in. So without further ado, let's head into Target and see the goods. Okay, we've arrived here. I'm really glad I waited until today to vlog because there are new things out that weren't here just last night. So one of the new things that I haven't shown yet are these little faux florals, $5. This is porcelain on the bottom. That's like a palish blue option. This one is my personal favorite. It is white and has these pale blue and pink flowers. I love the shape of the base there. This one's also five. And one more option. This blue one has a bit of like a tapered top. This one is straight all the way up and more of a dusty rose color with a white flower on the top. Also $5 on this one. And better look at the flowers that are in the blue one for you. So those are your three options there. That one would be my favorite. I think I've showed these little watering cans. They're not really cans, these porcelain waterers before. But they have all three, so just in case we haven't seen all three, there we go. I have this one at home. I love it. Put it on one of my shelves as a decor item when it's not in use, but it is also functional. All of the different mushrooms are here. We have this one that has like the grayish green color. Love the detailing of the cap underneath. $3 for that one that's shorter with a more broad base. We have a taller one with this rippled top. This one was not available when I first picked mine up. So I purchased this one, this one, and this one, and then found this one at a later point. So I do have one of each of them now. They're on my mantle in the living room. Just so you can see the comparison between these two. This one is a little bit shorter and has a bigger cap. And it is a light blue color. Still has the beautiful detailing underneath. And then lastly, we have this pink one that has a smooth top. And so you can see the comparison of these two. This one has a slightly wider base and is not quite as tall as that one. And so you can see the rippled edge, the smooth edge, and the varying or the variance between the colors. This guy is brand new to me. I have not seen him at all. He has, oh, he is heavy. He has a very beautiful gold hat. He is kind of sitting cross-legged. He is $5. He is heavy. 
also should mention that the price of each of the mushrooms is three dollars each these mushrooms are also brand new to me i'm assuming they're going to be heavy so i'm going to pick this up carefully i hope oh my gosh that is definitely heavy i had to readjust it just to pick it up oh my word okay that would be great for outside what are they calling this one count mushroom figural so i'm not sure how it would do outside by the weight of it i feel like it would be intended for use outside but there's nothing really specifying that so it is like a concrete looking material heavy enough to possibly be actual concrete and then has these little spots on the top that are filled in with gold paint and that is five dollars we've seen at least some of the variations of these little porcelain potters they have the drainage on the bottom five dollars comes in this blue color green and also that dusty rose color back there I don't think I've shared these little stands. Every time I see this, I just think of like American Girl dolls or my daughter's stuffed animals. $5, it is called a tiered tray, so you could certainly use it in other ways as well, but that's just where my mind goes every time I see it. These are new and I think they're beautiful. There are these rope baskets. The tops do come off. They're loosely attached with a little plastic piece for now before you purchase them, but once you purchase them, you could of course separate them and then you have the top and the bottom. That is about how they look. I feel like they're very classy looking and just $5. I'm seeing them in the gray color as well as this more neutral brownish tan color. They are actively stocking the dollar spot right now, so we will see what goodies we can spot in live time as they're coming out. This little basket is $5. We have a little knot here on the side, kind of shallow base. Also seeing a very similar one, but without the white on the top. It's all that natural weaved material. Another basket option down here. Got a handle just on one side that would be really cute to hang on the wall to drop your keys in as you're coming in or something of that nature five dollars for that one another basket option this does have a handle on either side with some tasseling at the end of the handles this one is five dollars and it is important to note that there's a pretty big difference between this size basket and this one as you can see here Finding these little shelf options. They are pretty heavy. The top is painted white, $5 here. They're also available with just the hooks without the top for $5 again. One more basket option that I am seeing. This is more of a gray color, two handles. And for size reference, it's closer in size to this one, though still a little bit smaller finding more new items over here. I am loving this. This is a floral backdrop. There are dimensions. Looks like this when you hang it. It is a metallic-y silver. Five dollars. I'm considering grabbing this just to, I don't know, maybe add to the playroom wall to add some visual excitement or maybe Charlie's room. I'm considering this anyway. I do really like it. Yeah. They also have a balloon arch kit, it includes 20 large balloons, 20 small balloons, one plastic connector strip, and 10 self-adhesive paper greenery add-ons. Whoa. And that is $5. That's pretty cool. Tapered candles are very in right now. We have a two set here of tapered candles. They are a gold ombre, fragrance-free, eight inches in height. These two candles are $3. We also have an all white option. Again, fragrance free and eight inches tall and $3. 20 warm white LEDs, clip starry lights. Okay. Battery operated, indoor use only, 9.5 feet in length. They look like this, $5. We have a 10 pack of chalkboard signs, perfect for parties or other festivities, and all 10 of these are $5. Ooh, I was not expecting that to be actual glass. I was expecting plastic. I'm impressed. That is actual glass, gold around the edge, 
$5 for this little cake stand. Little two packs of gold lanterns. These are $5 and they're battery operated. Here's another look at the cake stands for size reference. That's my hand. Finding some little shepherd's hooks, they're calling them. These are $5 for two. They come in gold or black. And the idea is that you could hook a little lantern to them. Specifically, I bet these lanterns would look great with them. That's a very cute idea. So go ahead and imagine that hanging from there or even with the black. Fancy. We have a little faux marble looking tray that does spin around in a circle. Has some variation to it to give it more dimension. This is $5. The tiniest little charcuterie boards. Those are wicked cute. Maybe if you're looking for individual charcuterie boards, two of them for $5. Okay, guys, you have still not answered me about what the heck these are or what they could be used for. They don't have a name. Item. They're just an item. They're $5. What the heck? What do I do with these? They keep adding more of them and people keep buying them. So I really need you to tell me what do we do with these? What are they for? Up here we have some other charcuterie type items. These are cheese knives. These are a pretty good looking little set of three for $3. These three little wooden spoons are adorable. $3 on these. You could put them in sugar, coffee, whatever you might be trying to scoop up and put into a mug or something. We have a spatula and tong set. These feel like good quality. They're $3 for the two. Six count of cheese markers on a ring for storage and those are three dollars as well my target has a ton of these little honey bears and they are popular people are after this dude he is five dollars it looks like my target is taking all of these st patrick's day items and i bet they're going to be moving them to a sale area we saw the little gnome before but guess what there's a little frog too Look at that guy, he's cute. I love the little gold detailing. I love the peaceful meditative way he's sitting. He is $5, not quite as heavy as the gnome, but still quite hefty. We have a couple of shades of woven throws here. These are $5. Here are the dimensions. They are not going to be like the warmest things, but they're very soft and very pretty and would add a little bit of warmth. Finding a couple of cute signs. This is our happy place. $5 for that. And it is a metal type material. Also this one that says welcome, as well as welcome to the garden. All $5. I know I've showed these birdhouses. I picked up one of each and I'm looking forward to putting them outside and I'm hoping that we'll have some birds that will actually nest in them this year, but we'll see. A lot of people are very excited about these like office shelf decor items that have been hitting the dollar spot, bookshelf decor. This is just $3 and it is metal and it is pretty heavy. This is another piece of bookshelf decor for $3. You get these three wooden chain links, not chain I guess, but these three wooden links. There is also a wooden knot like the one I just showed you, but it isn't here right now at my Target. I've showed it before though in one of my videos, but it's been a little while. We also have this and symbol that is some bookshelf decor for $3. I know I've shown these little bird cages before, but we'll just give them a moment again. $5 for these. Currently the top is taped to the bottom, but of course when you purchase it, you could take the top off and put whatever you want in there and treat it as decor. Some other watering options. This one is plastic, but it is very beautiful. It's got this gray speckling on it. It is a good size, as you can see. I love the narrow top. That would be easy to get under the leaves of plants. This water is $5. This is the only jar like this that I'm seeing at the moment, but I am sure there are more to come. 
This is $5 and they're calling it a terrarium. And that is actual glass with a cork like top. I bet there are more of these coming as well, but for now we have these little sunflower grow kits. They come with these adorable little metal tins. Complete grow kit, everything you need for $3. I know I've shared these before. They're great, still out. Slightly larger version. The smaller version is two for five. The larger version is one for five. Also seeing these porcelain planters that are made to look like they're woven. Pretty good size, size drainage in the bottom. And $5 on that. It also has the little feet to help it be gentle on whatever surface you might put it on. I am loving these. I am in a wedding this summer, so I'm extra interested in the wedding items that are out. Best day ever. Very cute. Five dollars. There's also this groom option. The groom established 2023. That is taller than this one. Another tall option that just says best day ever. That more squat version. Cheers, cheers, cheers. I do know that there are more variations of these, but they are just not out at the moment. This is too perfect, best day ever. Established 2023 and it just has like the basic things that you might find yourself needing. A little emergency kit for, could be used for a wedding day of course, but also could be used for other events. Love that. Just $3 for that emergency kit. We have some koozies. This one says the groom established 2023. This is $1. I only see the groom option right now, but I'm sure that there is a bride one, just as I'm sure there's a bride version of these drinkware items as well. This is quite cute. It says the bride. This is $3, just a little pouch that she could put whatever she might need in. There's also one that says, I do crew. I love that. There's some very exciting blingy drinkware. I feel like this was actually for New Year's, but maybe not. Maybe they just had something similar. But this is $3 for that very bright and fun drinkware item. Ooh, it's available in pink as well. We have some five count sets of reusable cups. They are 15.5 fluid ounces each. $5 for these. They come with the cup, the lid, and straws. We have the gold version. We have a clear version that does have, ooh, that does have some shiny spots on the bottom. I love that. And we Go also fair. have um, a pink version. Oh, and we have a version that says best day ever. We have an electric cleaning brush. Okay, showing that it could be used in a variety of locations for five dollars. Vivitar brand. Interesting. Also by Vivitar there is this three-piece cleaning brush head refill set. Features. So I'm feeling like the soap is like in the brush. Bris bristle brush head, sponge brush head, and exfoliating brush head. All right, five dollars for that three set of refills. A laptop sun and privacy shade. That could be great if you are needing that kind of item. Five dollars. Feels like good quality. There's all kinds of items by this Vivitar brand. A grip and hold with a wristlet. So you've got like a pop socket item and you also have this little lanyard leash type thing. Five dollars. Comes in a couple of other variations as well. We have some little battery operated fans for $5. I see a blue one, a white one, and a pink one. This whole area is just all Vivitar items. We have a multi-port charging hub, and that is $5. We also have some Vivitar power strips for $5. We have this kind of teal option, and also white. I can first see these baskets being very popular. There's this version that has an opening here on the side, and then also this version that has the two handles on the side. This is $5, and of course they can be stacked. Great way to add some organization to a variety of spaces from pantries to desk areas. 
and anywhere else really. Keeping in mind kind of the wedding theme or the pampering yourself theme. Heatless curler kit. Five dollars on this. You get four total pieces in there. We have a hair wrap for three dollars. It's 100% polyester, machine washable. We have a brush holder, one count, use flat or standing, two options, that's pretty exciting, $3. We have a wrap spa towel with Velcro closure and an elastic back, and that is $5. We have some other like bath related items, we have a little bath mitt here for $3. We have a back scrubber, exfoliating and cleaning for $3. And we have a cute little dry brush body exfoliator again for $3. A little utensil set. It includes one fork, one spoon, one knife, and a case. That is $3. This one says fancy, fancy a what? Okay, it says fancy a picnic. Also available in this pink option that says nom nom nom. Okay, I worked so hard to see what it said. Look. I just could have paid attention to the label a little bit better. And we have this kind of reddish option that says for snack emergencies. I feel like these are going to be very popular. We have a plastic lid decorative with these florals. I love that. You know I love florals. Glass on the bottom for $5. And it is intended for use with food. There's also this round option with a blue lid and these blue florals on it. Again, $5. Wow, I had to work really hard to get this one down for you. White florals, pinkish lid, square-ish option again. We have some storage boxes down here. Ooh, with a mirror on the top. Storage box with mirror, $5. And a little handle. Some very beautiful little water bottles. They come matching, oh gosh, no, don't do that. <laughs> they match the different colored lids of those glassware items. So we have white, that tealish, and the pinkish color. These are only $5. They have that wooden looking lid. What is the amount of water they hold? Okay, unknown how much it will hold, but there you go for size reference with my hand. An adjustable drawer organizer. I do not know if I understand. Oh, okay. I now understand. Thank you for that picture. And this adjustable drawer organizer is by Vivitar and is $5. We have some beautiful little wire baskets. It's white, teal, more of a pinkish maroon color. These are $5. So we've moved into the gardening items. We have this gardening trowel. It is this pinkish red color. Beautiful for $5. Also available in teal. The mom items are coming out as we are getting closer to Mother's Day. This is a little tote bag, $3. It says mom in florals. I am a bit of a bag lady. I have plenty of bags. I absolutely do not need this one, but I love it because of the background color as well as the florals. And one more option that looks like it's just plain. These are great. I've grabbed some in the past for my kids and we've decorated them and they have used them as their bags to get books at the library. A couple of plastic planter options. We do have that drainage on the bottom, $5 for these. We see them in this like pinkish brown color, teal, and also this white with gray speckling. The garden kneeler, you are my sunshine. That's a special saying in my family. There's the size on that and $5. Also this teal version that says bloom where you are planted. A couple of new candle options out. It does say it's scented. It smells good to me. I don't really know what the scent is. It says thank you. It is $3. Oh, fresh cut lilacs. It smells really good. This one says super mom. And this scent is sea salt mist. Sea salt mist also smells good. This one is sugared lemon. Ooh, that one smells good too. They all smell nice to me. We have a couple, we have a couple of little glass mug options. A mother like no other, $3. And we have this option that says proud plant parent. And these are $3. We also have a variety of gardening related socks, $3. Those are the three that you would get in the set. 
And we also have these little visor hats. These look very cute for the summertime. Easy to just pack and take with you. And for only $5, it's okay if you bring it to the beach and it blows off and gets wet. A little straw, straw visor. And whoa, they are unboxing a ton of stuff for the dollar spot. I'm gonna peruse the kids' items that they have out real quick. We have a little Terrarium Friends puzzle, five plus, that is cute. Hmm. 50 piece puzzle. I feel like the kids' items are not always great about having a price, but there's this puzzle. Oh, right here, three dollars. And also this puzzle option. We have a couple of water bottle options. Looks like Disney Princess is there. Spider-Man here. Three dollars on that. Okay, and the idea is you could put a little snack in the bottom. Found one more, a Paw Patrol version. These would be great to stick in Easter baskets. And they also come with these little like lanyards on them, so I think they're long enough. They look like the kids could even wear them. Seeing a couple of hat options, Disney princesses, Mickey, we have a Mickey lover in our house. Also Minnie Mouse back there, and these hats are $5. Oh, there's a whole bunch of umbrella options. We've got Minnie Mouse. We have Elsa and Anna. This looks like Paw Patrol. Um, Batman. Oh my goodness. Colin would love the Batman one. These umbrellas are how much? What is that? Five dollars. Some little LED mood lights, a cocoa melon option here. I have turned this thing all over. It legitimately does not have a price on it. Also seeing this Paw Patrol option, as well as a unicorn here, Spider-Man, Minnie Mouse. I don't think I see any others. There's some little activity sets, a little activity art set. Here are the contents. These are $5. I see the princess option, Peppa Pig, Encanto over there. What else do we have? Oh, Gabby's Dollhouse. Are there any others? Oh, we saw Encanto. Peppa Pig, we saw that. Oh, we do have a Mickey one. And I think, I think that's it. We have some various drawing pads. Paw Patrol, Mickey and Friends, Coco Melon. They're the Imagine Ink brand. So they, the magic reveals games inside when you color it. And wait, these are $3. Last time we were here, Colin saw these and was obsessed with them. We do have a pool and they like to bring things like this in the pool. These do seem like they would be great for that. Bright LED lights, three diving torpedoes, slices through the water, launch, dive, and catch. And these are only $3. You know what, I think I'm gonna grab a set and gift it to them as like a combined Easter gift. Oh, but there are multiple colorways. Okay, but are there three different colorways? I don't know. If there are three different ones, then I could get three. They don't each need their own though. Pro tip, verify that they all do as they are supposed to before you purchase. Oh my goodness. These are fun, but I always hate the little plastic bits that they leave behind once they've been filled and popped. But this is here if this is something you're interested in. Fill and tie, 30 inch water balloons in 20 seconds. There are over 30 of them for $3. I see them in pink and orange at the moment. Light up bubble blower, comes with the bubbles. That looks like a lot of fun for $5. I see a unicorn. Excuse me, I stand corrected. $3? What the heck? Also in a T-Rex version, as well as a shark. $3 is pretty great. Even if you only get one season out of them, $3 is worth it. We have some light up skip balls. I think these are supposed to look like fruits. This looks like a pineapple to me. And then we have, I don't know, that pink one, whatever that is. And this is like a watermelon or a cactus. I'm not really sure. $5 for those. A bubble pinwheel, three fluid ounces. 
includes the bubble mixture with it. These are fun. Kids always love bubbles, right? And these are what? These are a lot of fun over here. Three dollars for this little pouch of squirt toy animals. They've got this set. They've also got this set. A couple of other art options. Little green thumb plant stakes that kids can decorate themselves. It is a four pack with eight Crayola paints. Three dollars. Or we have this sun catcher paint and display set. Again, three dollars. Scratch art sets. We've got the dinosaur version or backyard bugs. As well as unicorns. Let's see that one. These are three dollars per set. This is quite cute. You can paint these little critters. You have a snail and a butterfly in a pack together. Here's what it comes with. Three dollars. Or for three dollars, there's also this gnome. These are very cute and exciting little bug catchers. Look at that little ladybug door. It comes with all of these things in it for five dollars. There's also this little gardening kit. Here are the things that come in it, $5 again for this. There is also another bug catcher that is shaped like a mushroom and has a little red lid. I scooped up three of them last night as Easter gifts for my kids, so when I get home I will show those to you because they don't have any more right now. As promised, here are the little bug catchers that I picked up last night. These are $5 and these are the contents. At first I was worried about the safety of the bugs in there, but there are little holes in them. So I loved this option because the sides are all plastic and I feel like it's gonna hold up a little bit better than the mesh sides of the other one that I showed you in the dollar spot today. They have some silly scented dough options. This looks like it's an Easter themed item. Oh, these things never have prices on them. It's priceless. I'm assuming $3, maybe a dollar, but probably three. It does also come in this variety. Quickly perusing the Easter items. We have seen these. I have shown them, but there they are again, just in case you didn't catch any of my other vlogs. Check them out, though, if you want more specific Easter decor. Again, these are all more Easter items that we have seen in previous vlogs egg-shaped cutting boards, these little plastic cake tray things. Over here there are a bunch of 50% off clearance items at my Target, so check yours out. There might be some similar items that are 50% off at your Target. Are these baskets really 50% off? The answer is I do not know because that says folding a table and uh, none of these things are folding tables. And this one says floor mats and none of these things are floor mats. So. I don't know, I, this is the only one here, and then there are several of these, so I'm assuming they are 50% off, but can't be sure. Excuse me, I think I skipped over these. These little jar sets with gold hardware on them, $5 for these two little ones. Also available in a much larger option, same gold hardware, and this is $5. We have a bunch of these from Ikea in our pantry. We store pasta in them and you could store a whole variety of dry goods. I love them. We have seen these boots, but quickly just throwing those into this vlog for you. I don't know what's going on over here, why they have all of this stuff stacked up. I think maybe it's just stuff that they don't, I wanna say stuff they don't have space for, but some of these things have already been out. Like those have definitely already been out. So maybe they're just more coming in that aren't, aren't out yet I'm not sure but this stuff looks current so I don't think it's like headed for clearance or anything like that probably just waiting to be shelved okay there are already less of these than when I first looked at them so I'm gonna grab one right now I'm also giving in to the tapered candle trend or craze for three dollars I might as well just grab some and now with that I need to go get a cart because I am going to have a hard time holding on to items and filming and when I tell you they have a ton of stuff to unbox, I mean they have a ton of stuff. That's not even the half of it, but I don't want to get closer because I want to give them space to do their job. But a whole lot of stuff. 
And one final cruise over some Easter items that we have already seen. A few more Easter goodies. And that's going to be it for the Target Dollar Spot for today. Wow, there's a lot of space on the shelves, but we did still find a lot of stuff. Just kidding, I missed, I missed an end cap. We have some bath crayons for a pack, neon colors for a dollar. We also have some more primary colors. A couple of finger paint soaps. I'm sure that more will come. We have Firefly Red, Flamingo Pink, and Royal Purple at the moment. Slay All Day Stardust, Berry Scented Bath Bomb Crumbles. Okay, sounds like it would smell great. A dollar there. A couple of other bath bomb options. Jojo Siwa. I feel like these bouncy balls that have a light in them and some little glittery decor items are always out. We have rainbows. Oh, we have one that is not water filled. I like that a little bit more because sometimes the water does break open. So bunnies and frogs that do not have water in them. Also flowers. And instead of water, they have beads. But we do have plenty with water and other goodies. Hearts. Ladybugs. Reindeer, we've seen that one before. I don't know why that's still out. But anyway, you get the point. Whole co a whole bunch of them, all kinds. Tried to say both of those at the same time. That didn't work out. We have four pieces of neon sidewalk chalk for an unknown price. I'm assuming a dollar, but that, that isn't what that is. But I'm assuming a dollar. We have some smaller play pack options for a dollar. Whole bunch of different characters and options. We have some legit Play-Doh air dry clay packs. That's super cute. And, oh, surprise, no price. Based on the size, I wanna say a dollar, but I'm not positive. We have some Play-Doh sculpt and mold clay. This is a dollar, Play-Doh clay. So if this is a dollar, I bet this is too. Okay, these look fun. Squid Pops, Bubble Fidget Strip, Lay Flat, and Pull. Okay, so we are intentionally sticking it to things and pulling it off. A dollar. Several different colorways for these. Those would be great to throw in the Easter baskets. For, for a dollar a piece, you can't really go wrong. Might grab some of these myself. And these, I love these. I talked about them before. We just have a container in our playroom that's like the running storage for these and for various holidays I get them a new set because they have different colors at different times of the year so probably I'm gonna grab <coughs> probably I'm gonna grab the kids each one of these more like springy pastel ones so that we can just keep adding to our set but right now we also have the neon colors and then the primary colors out Charlie and I were here about a week ago and I caved and I bought our first Dash Mini Waffle Maker. And that's the one we purchased. I am now loving this honeycomb one. I don't think I need two for a single season, so that one's not really of interest to me. Really enjoy that one, but uh, am I gonna do this? Am I gonna be one of those people that now collects Dash wash Waffle Makers? I do not need to do this. I'm gonna walk away from this honey one at this time, this honeycomb one, but I like it and I don't know how long I'll be able to resist. Here are the items that we scooped up from the dollar spot. Wow, it's so much quieter over here than it was over there in the dollar spot by the door. But that's what we've preemptively picked up and we'll see if I revise and remove anything. But I'm feeling pretty good about all of it. These are larger. I wanted to point these out because we just saw some that are quite similar in the dollar spot with the same opening like this and also this version that doesn't have the opening. These, like I said, are larger. However, I just want to point out the difference. The ones in the dollar spot were $5 a piece, of course smaller, but these ones are $12 a piece. That's a huge difference for not a ton of size difference. So just be mindful of that. I know these ones are great quality. I have quite a few bright room items myself. I do love them but I also like to be budget friendly. So know that the dollar spot has an option that could be a better fit for you right now if you're looking to be financially savvy. Oh gosh, these are new and adorable. This is that like melamine type plate. 
This is their dinner bowl. This is by Threshold, $3. Look at those little oranges, maybe peaches. Also come in this little set, two cube. We have another colorway option. These look like maybe lemons. Again, dinner bowl and two small bowls. And then we have a pears in a blue colorway with the two little bowls. The bowls and dinner plates are $3 each. Sorry, dinner bowls and small bowls. And if you would like to match, there is a pack of napkins for $3 as well as some coasters for $3. Too cute. And not really matching per se, but we have a little utensil caddy here for $8. This is a woven material. We also have this serving tray for $15. That's a good size. And then we have a two pack of chargers for $6. Some new pillow and bedding options. That is a beautiful pillow. It does not look like it has a removable zipper cover. That's $20. We also have this slightly more like lumbar shaped pillow for $20. Here we have a reversible floral sham. The sham is $15. We have the quilt here for $69. That's a very delicate neutral print. I think this is my personal favorite in this collection. 15 for this sham, 59 for this quilt, and it is called a lofty crinkle quilt. Love that color. I know, I know, you know I love my florals, so I do like this option as well. 15 for the sham, 69 for this quilt. On the other side, it is that colorway, so you could put it on either side, I believe. Woodblock printed quilt, it's called. And one more solid option, this is that same crinkly one, but now in blue, 15 for the sham, 59 for the quilt. Oh, and it has those little X's on it to sort of keep things held together. That's a nice little detail. We have some beautiful faux floral options coming out. These are all 10 and under. These little mini wreaths are $10. Great statement for a smaller space. This option is 10 as well as this one. We have this little faux bundle. I don't see a price on these ones. Looks like $3 on the little faux bundle. There's this $3 bundle option. Those are some beautiful florals. And then we have a couple of potted ones for $5. This one is probably my personal favorite. I really like just the ones that are solid green plants versus the florals. We have a couple of base filler options for $10 each. Oh, look at this set of succulents. The succulents come with 10 pieces. This vase filler has 100 pieces, 9 pieces, and 9 pieces, all $10 each. I had to stop and check these out because I am loving them. These are $40 for these 16 quart coolers. That translates to 30 liters. They have little wheels, a little handle, also a telescoping, is that what you call it, handle? So you could roll it behind you. They're just these nice, bright, fun colors. We have this pinkish version, this very bright neon yellow, and then also this teal option. I feel like these bright colors are just really coming back right now. I'm not going to spend any kind of amount of time really going through all of this, but there are a ton of summer items out for kids. Pools, floaties, water sprinkler items, water balloon items, water guns, just all kinds of summer fun items. We have these torpedoes. I can tell you they last and they last well. They lived in our pool for the entirety of last summer. And even when we were not using them, they live their life at the bottom of the pool and they still look great. So they are worth the $5. A whole nother aisle of summer items. Wow, a ton of life jackets, a ton of bubble options. Oh my gosh, the bubble options just continue. Bubbles, bubbles galore. This is pretty unrelated to the rest of the vlog, but I just have to comment on how funny it is to me that this style shoe with like the big chunky heel is coming back because this was very popular when I was young, like 10 and under, and 
I don't know. I don't know how I feel about it coming back. I kind of love it, I guess. But yeah, I don't know. I just find it funny. All right, back out to the car. Final little haul here. Grabbed the tapered candles. Grabbed each of the kids a set of these like eastery feeling what do they even call these? Building blocks. I did grab a set of these divers to share, and I actually think it'll be perfect. I'll just put one in each of their Easter baskets. They'll play with them all together, but that's how I'll divvy them out for the Easter baskets. And then also grab this floral backdrop because I just really like it. And it's simple, and it's one of those things that I can just hang on a wall, make a statement, and if it ends up getting messed up because I have kids and pets, no big deal not didn't break the bank so it'll be fine I'm gonna link one of my favorite youtubers Allison in my description box because something that she really loves to do is paint these tapered candles and she does this for a lot of the holidays at least she has recently during Valentine's Day she put some little hearts on a set of them and she recently did some for springtime and put little flowers on them and it's just a really cute idea cute way, simple craft and a cute way to customize some tapered candles for your home. So I will link her because I really enjoy watching her vlogs and you may too. And that is it for this trip into Target. There were some great things in the dollar spot. I just, I say this every season, but I love all of the new items that they come out with in the dollar spot. I feel like they really take feedback and they look at the trends and they try to produce items that are both matching what people want and what the trends are pointing towards. So I think they're doing a great job. They're killing it in the dollar spot. I am noticing that the pricing of items in the dollar spot is more in that three and five dollar range lately, but I do really feel like the quality of the items is there. So that increase in price on some items feels warranted to me. I very seldomly come across an item that I feel like is overpriced and more often I feel like I come across items that I'm surprised are a lesser price than I was expecting. So Dollar Spot still has my heart. I'll keep coming back here. I'll keep making vlogs for you on this space. But let me know, did you see anything in today's video that you feel like you would like to add to your collection or that you felt was a great price for a good quality item? Let me know in the comments. I'd love to come and chat with you. Thank you so much for joining me today. Can't wait to see you in the next one. Bye.